Alright guys, in today's episode, we're gonna make the balloons ten times as strong! Yeah, boy! Luckily for us, we do have infinite range hacks on. So now the question is though, what does ten times strength look like? So, with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Holy cow, that is a lot. Okay. We need to get triple shots and we need to start. Oh my gosh, these balloons are deadly. Holy cow. This is devastating. But here's the question. Do they take double lives? Oh, but the but here's the thing. Tax shooters do a pretty good job. So we need things that like instantly pop balloons, I think. Look at his pops. Oh my gosh, he already has 200 pops. We need Oh my gosh, but it so they still only count as one life luckily. We have $800. Having a dartling gunner could be really nice here. A ninja could also be nice. I think the first thing I want to do is I want to have a tack. Oh my gosh. I forgot they put tacks everywhere. So, okay. The tack is really good to have. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of balloons. Oh my goodness. Okay. We need uh, long reach. Okay. I don't really think long reach is going to help us out that much. Okay. This is going to be devastating. This guy's already got 800 pops. We're going to need a little bit of help. All right, guys. I've changed my mind. I need two cash drops. That's all I want. And I'm going to use that to get a bank. All I want, all I want for Christmas is a bank, and I can't afford the bank. Guys, this is bad. This is really bad. We're already losing. Uh, here, let's get a ninja. Let's get a ninja. Ninja discipline, sharp shurikens. Let's get, and I, if I can get double shot, that also might help. Holy cow. Look at how hard it is to pop balloons. This guy's doing okay. We are very much so struggling to pop these balloons. Oh, you know what's really, what we really need is an engineer monkey. What is balloon trap? Balloon trap's $3,000. We need to get balloon trap immediately, guys, or else we're in trouble. Okay, we need balloon trap. Uh, that's three thousand dollars, though. We're probably gonna lose by then. We only have sixteen lives left. I don't know if it's gonna be possible. We're trying our best here. How much money is in there? That's only a thousand dollars. That's not. That's not helping. That's not helping in the slightest. I mean, we're trying to. We're ooh, oversized nails, I guess. Holy cow, we're gonna lose, guys. That's devastating. There's bigger stacks, even faster production. Okay. I think that's gonna help out. If we can get all of these things that are gonna put down spikes everywhere, that's gonna that's gonna be a lot better. Yeah, this spike factory is doing good. Glue monkey. We need a glue monkey, especially with global range. I could see that being very, very useful. But I think we wanna save up and get balloon trap as quickly as possible. I think getting yeah, getting a glue trap is a balloon trap is gonna be the most important thing. How many look at this guy. This guy is Moab Shredder is going to be really nice. We're already at round 13. We're slowly kind of just bleeding lives now. I wonder if sentry guns are going to be... Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we need balloon trap now. Okay. Well, there we go. We're going to... We're struggling here. But now we have balloon trap. And balloon trap is going to... There we go. Balloon trap is going to make our lives a lot easier to have. And it's going to help us give us a uh, some sort of... What? Where's our balloon trap? There we go. Why did... Oh, no. Regen balloons. Regen balloons are like our worst nightmare guys. Okay, we want a bomb shooter and we want to get frag bombs And then we want bigger bombs and heavy bombs because having that extra range and that aoe damage is oh my gosh We've lost again. This is intense. Let's put a glue gunner down. Okay glue gunner. Let's do stickier glue stronger glue glue splatter There we go. Now we're gonna be doing a lot better because he's just gonna be slowing everything down and then we're going to want to get glue splatter, which is pretty expensive, but it, it co coats up to six layers of balloon. He's just going to constantly be putting glue on like all of the balloons, which is going to be really nice. How do we deal with the first Moab? That is the question. Probably a pirate ship. So let's uh, let's start leveling up a pirate ship. We'll do grape shot, hot shot, faster shooting, and let's also get like double shot. Okay, there we go. Holy cow. We're actually doing it. We're starting to like we're starting to kind of deal with the with the balloons. <gasps> we have money. We have money. We need more money. We are I this is we're we're doing okay for ourselves. Let's get do we want one more bank? I don't think we can even afford another bank, honestly. Do we go for another bank or do we try to level this guy up? Well, we're going to want to get a cannon ship. Uh let's get a cannon ship. That's going to be very important to get. Look at this. Oh my gosh, it's so difficult to, to pop these things. I need Moab Shredder and I need to get Spike Factory. If we can get Spike Factory, Spike Factory is going to be so useful because that actually like pops balloons. 
Right, look at this. That's 8,000. This guy's at 8,000. Like, oh my goodness. This is the only guy that can deal with camos as well. Oh my goodness. He has to pop so many balloons. Remember, everything has 10 times health, guys. Eventually, we do need monkey pirates in order to absorb Moab class balloons because there's no way we can take out a normal Moab class balloon without help, right? Like, there's. Oh my goodness. There's no way here. We need. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. We need to collect. Uh, we have. I need. I did. I collected. Oh wait. I didn't collect. Okay, that's fine. All right. Now we have Spike Storm. Spike Storm is gonna be very useful in case like something bad happens, right? Where it's like, oh look at this rush, right? Oh, actually we're doing okay. What is popping? This has 17,000 pops. Okay, we definitely are gonna want more of that. Here, let's. There we go. See, we can use the Spike Storm, and the Spike Storm is is going to really help out. It's really going to help out. Uh-oh. Uh, no! I lost, guys. Okay, we need a village. Anything that we can slow down going from through from there. There we go. Use this ability now. And now we can also go ahead and get monkey pirates, which is going to be pretty nice. Okay, take this all out. Take it all out. There we go. Okay, there we go. We're just absorbing that. I am not dealing with a Moab class balloon right now. A Moab class balloon is way too strong and powerful, guys. There we go. I would very much so like to get some more... It may be more Rays of Doom might be able to do a lot more damage. Here, we can use this ability. Look at this. That's got 17,000 pops. Let's get Jungle Drums, because if everything gets Jungle Drums and attacks faster... Oh, lots more money. Okay. Uh, more banks. More... Oh, Ceramic Balloons. Holy cow, Ceramic Balloons. I am not ready to deal with Ceramic Balloons. What about, let's get, okay, okay, slow down, slow down. Everything needs to chill out. Let's get, let's get two banks at least, two more banks. Because we're going to need, we're going to definitely need more damage. That leaves us with $14,000 plasma accelerator. There we go. There we go. And now what we'll do is I'm going to lock this guy in place right here. And there we go. Okay, we dealt with that. These balloons are devastating. To have to deal with i want more bomb shooters more bomb shooters is going to be very beneficial for us there we go because he's just gonna they're all they're gonna constantly do extra damage and what the heck why not let's throw down our hero having like everything we can is going to be nice to have oh man oh how are we dealing with that look at that that's just like one ceramic there we go how is this looking? Yeah, look at this guy. 15,000 pops. That's like, okay. That's not, honestly, that's not that impressive. What can we do get that's going to be able to do even more damage? That's just going to like shred balloons for us, right? Something that's always going to be doing a lot of pierce and a lot of damage. Oh, man. Oh, man. Um, okay, let's, uh, okay, we need monkey. We're going to upgrade to monkey intelligence bureau. And we're going to also go ahead and just get more bomb shooters. Look at that. We can barely deal with that. Okay, more. We need just as many recursive clusters as we can get. N I'm not joking, guys. As many. If we can just get a ton of... A ma Look at this. Look at this Moab. Oh, man. We just were barely able to deal with that Moab. Okay. There we go. Bigger bombs, heavy bombs. As many recursive... Global recursive cluster bombs as we can. That is wonderful. Okay. Let's see, how are we doing with money-wise? $22,000, not bad. Um, global, what is going to be really nice to have here? Uh, it's trying its best here. That's $28,000. let us upgrade this guy to Balloon Jitsu, which is just even more darts, which is going to be really nice. A lot of global damage is really what we need. Wait, if balloons are 10, if balloons are 10 times stronger... Is a Necromancer going to be 10 times stronger? I don't know. Here's here's to seeing if, if a Necromancer is going to be 10 times stronger. I don't think he is, though. Oh, I it's kind of annoying because since he's he's going to be put all the way at the back, though, because he has global range. So, that, so that's a problem. Uh, $36,000. Not bad here. We're going to we're going to absorb that guy. We need, a, we need more glow. We need, okay, we're going to get a couple more pirates. We're going to get a few more pirates. I mean, they're global ranged anyway, so, like, it's fine, right? Having a bunch of just global range pirates, yeah. That's helping us out. Look at all these pops. 
These guys are all doing a very, very good job. The best thing for us is going to be a brewmaster. All right, absorb that guy. I'm not, I am not dealing with that. I'm not, I do not want to deal with any type of BFE or shenanigan or like anything. I don't want to deal with any of that. We need a brewmaster though. We're going to have to eventually, we will get a, uh, we need permanent brew. Like we're going to have to get a permanent brew because he will put permanent buff on everything. And having a permanent buff on everything is going to be very important. There we go. We're going to absorb. Oh, not a fortif- I cannot, I can't deal with any fortified Moab. There's no way. There is no way I can deal with a fortified Moab right now. It just, I can't. I can't. We're still, we're having like super duper troubles dealing with most stuffs. Uh, we're at $40,000, but I think we get even extra money, but I, I could be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure we get way more money now because everything takes way more to pop. Holy cow. All right. We're going to absorb all of those. Can we deal with that? Oh man. How's this necromancer looking? I think this die. I think he does get extra damage. Don't quote me on that, but I'm, I'm, I think he gets extra damage because the bull since balloons are 10 times as strong. Those are technically balloons. So I'm pretty sure that he is getting, in fact, bonus damage from that. This permanent brewmaster is going to be value because every everyone's going to get the permanent brew effect. All right, there we go. We're taking, we're not dealing with any BF. I want to see if we can destroy a ZoMG naturally. Like, I want to see if that's going to, if that is going to be a possibility. We're also going to want glo uh, glue... We're gonna want a couple of things, actually. This glue gunner has been nice, but we actually, we're gonna change a couple of things. So we're gonna collect this. And first things first, I want a permanent brew. I want a different glue gunner. So we're gonna do that. And then we're also gonna do glue soak and also corrosive glue. And I'm gonna want him to slow down like Moab class balloons. The, look at this, look at how much damage this is. Absolutely insane. I'm gonna put this guy on strong. So this guy is gonna attack strong balloons, but what we're gonna do now is I want a different I want a secondary glue gunner. This glue gunner is gonna be target on first, and this guy is gonna be a balloon dissolver, and we're gonna put him on that. So this guy's job is just gonna be slowing down Moab class balloons. This guy is to put his glue on as many as like littler balloons and just melt everything. I love that this guy has like a gas mask and like a protective suit, but his hands and feet are open. And his hands and feet are what's most susceptible to have to deal with all of that stuff. All right, there we go. Did he get gloves? I don't know. I think he's got, like, fingerless gloves. And he's got feet now. So at least this glue, gun glue monkey's a little bit smarter. Yeah, look at this. Look at how slow that guy's going. Everything seems to be getting, like, super duper stunned. Wait, why is it being stunned? All the, the Moabs don't seem to be able to move. But I don't know what would be stunning them. Also, XXL Trap is going to be really nice to have. But we're actually doing it now, which is kind of crazy. We're finally being able to pop these balloons. Yeah, look at this. 2,000 pops. Very nice. Let's get... We're going to save up the money. Six rounds until round 80, guys. This has been absolutely insane. What we're going to do as soon as this gets to maximum money, we're going to sell that. Also, we need, to, we need to take... Oh, my goodness. Why can't the Moabs move? I think this guy's making them, like, permanently stuck. I think so. I don't know why, but he's making it so they can't move. Do we sell them and find out? That's a lot of lost money. Let's let's see. I'm gonna sell him. Can Moab still move? He was making Moabs not be able to move at all. That is overpowered. That's so nice. Okay, let's also get the balloon solver, because he's gonna help just melt balloons. We de we need this guy to really 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 help with Mo. Oh, let's do this. Uh, let's sell this. We're going to put an ice monkey here. Wait, 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 wait. There's no way. I highly doubt that this works. No way does all, does everything get slowed now? I think all, since it's global range, everything gets slowed. That's amazing. Let's see if we're going to be able to defeat this guy. Uh, let's also get, oh yeah, we can get a sniper monkey. And then we can put this guy and then, then have on target strong as well. There we go. And everything also has permanent brew. Let's see how this uh, ZoMG holds up. Look at this. Like, look at how many pops. 5,000. Look at these. So this guy is 20,000 here. Let's upgrade him to the sub commander. Look at how many pops. Look at his pops. Look at how strong he is. 
There we go, guys. Oh my gosh. That took so many pops to be able to do that. I want to see... Holy cow, guys. I think we did it. Okay, guys. Pop count. 3.5 million balloons. Now, if you guys know, basically, if you get to round 80, normally it's 350,000 balloons. So... It was actually 3.5 million balloons because it was 10 times as difficult. If you guys enjoyed this or you want to see me try to go even further with 10 times the challenge, hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Thanks for watching, everyone. You're all beautiful. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for some more awesome content. Bye, everyone.